I like your night out. I'm, I'm getting to that age. I'm, I'm growing up. I've got mates getting married and having children. This is new to me. My life's changing. You don't get a night out as often. The weekend is no longer an excuse in itself. You don't get a night out. It's rare. But when, it, when they happen, it's a rollover and they go on far too long. <laughs> I think anybody can party with the newly married man, the new, the new father. That's, I, hear, I hear One Direction singing. We're gonna go crazy, crazy, crazy. <laughs> Until they see the sun. And rappers singing, gonna party. Until six in the morning. All oh, these parties that have got scheduled end times. <laughs> That's not what happens when your mates start getting married and having children and you get a night out. They go on far too long. People don't want to go back <laughs> to the life that they're creating for themselves. Mayhem ensues at the suggestion of a six in the morning curfew. <laughs> He's what to call it a night. Monty f man, one mere hour, the spar's open, we'll go and get cans. <laughs> the adult empty, it's a bleak affair, the empty, ten years on. <laughs> Some paranoid wreck walking through your living room looking for a Nokia charger. Seventeen missed calls, I better text her. <laughs> Highlights of a game of FIFA on the PlayStation that was finished about three hours ago. Still playing. <laughs> Two guys snorting cocaine, talking about a fight they had in primary school. Listen, I'm glad we sorted that the night, bud. <laughs> Me and all, mate, I was out of order that playtime. I was out of order. <laughs> Thirty-five-year-old guy still using expressions like playtime. <laughs> that was me. It was out of order, mate. I'm the one that kept throwing fizzy cola bottles at you. I knew. <laughs> You had to be seen to be doing something about that, mate. I understand. You, know, you never need to call us a VL, but that was out of order on your part. <laughs> At six in the morning, Nokia guy arguing with his missus by text. I told you I was having a mad one. <laughs> his only justification for having a mad one. He told her he was having a mad one. <laughs> and then staying on the offensive. I thought you were going to your mum's to watch Strictly anyway. <laughs> it's six o'clock in the morning, Ryan. How the f am I supposed to know what time Strictly finishes? <laughs> then looking at the telly, looking at the PlayStation, thinking it's Sky Sports. Here, when did Motherwell beat Columbia? <laughs> That's some result for the well, isn't it? <laughs> Columbia have their full team playing, eh? <laughs> oh, I should stock money on that. Seven red cards. Is there a bit of needle between the two? <laughs> Six in the morning. That's tough. Watching guys grow up against their will. Watching somebody going through an old VHS case that's been used as a joint rolling station for years. <laughs> Raking through the paraphernalia, trying to find something smokable. <laughs> there's a bit of green in there, I'll press my finger on that. <laughs> ah, there's plenty here, gentlemen, the night is but young. <laughs> ah, a bit of green stuff, tobacco, scrape that in, hells. There's always hells in the rolling tree. Ah, I'll put the pubes in, who gives a shit? <laughs> Lying there in emotional purgatory, trying to get a knackered disposable lighter to work. The only lighter in the party. <laughs> Them big long flicks. I'm on your piece of <laughs> Eventually, getting a bit of blue flame and going, yes, and then the S blows it straight back out again. <laughs> it's hard to watch a married man lighting a pube joint off the toaster. <laughs> 